My name is Tom Deans and I'm the CEO of Deanix. I've been with Deanix over 40 years and uh, the last 20 years as a CEO. I've been happy with Deanix development and uh, us providing clean air over the last many years. However, the world is changing and we see new transition in the industry in the next 40 to 50 years, uh, which also means new renewable energies, uh, electric vehicles, and also fuel cell trucks. We still believe that the combustion engine will last for many years ahead, but I'm happy to announce today that we will also move into fuel cell development, so we'll be part of the future many years ahead. Uh, the very heart of uh, hydrogen fuel cell is the catalyst coated membrane or CCM. This is the component uh, where the electrochemical uh, reactions uh, with hydrogen and oxygen take place to generate electricity. Hundreds of these um, catalyst coated membranes are all uh, stacked together to form a fuel cell. Catalyst and coating uh, are core, core competencies of uh, DNEX uh, from our exhaust after treatment uh, technologies. Uh, we, we are now relying uh, on this knowledge and expanding it to uh, develop uh, the catalyst coated membranes. Our target is to develop the CCMs, optimize them in terms of efficiency and cost and industrialize them. Hydrogen will be one of the most important energy carriers in the heavy duty transportation sector. In 2050, Two-thirds of the energy will be supported by hydrogen or e-fuels made from renewable energy. Fuel cells now are one of the most important technologies and the most efficient technology to use the energy stored in hydrogen. So uh, making the most out of every kilowatt hour uh, produced from renewable energies. Our catalyst coated membranes will support this high efficiency level of fuel cells and we are so excited to show our first prototypes in 2024 and uh, we will be ready to ramp up our production as soon as the demand increases. So with this move we, we lay the foundations for many years ahead that Deenix will still be a part of a cleaner and greener world. Thank you.